What's up YouTube? This is Dave Tatton of 187. This is a video to do with 30 seconds to 60 frames and a lot of lagging problems. Um, first off I want to show you The Last of Us in 30 frames and then show you what it looks like in 60 frames. That's why I see a big difference. I'm not big on resolutions but this whole 30 frames to 60 frames, I'm pretty big on that. I enjoy that. Um, see, now this is The Last of Us in 30 frames. You can literally lock it at 30 frames. And to me, you'll see the big, I see the big difference when it goes to 60 frames. It's just like night and day to me. Um, and pretty much out throughout this video too, I want to show you some problems that I have been having with, um, uh, just lag issues in these games. I guess it has stuff to do with uh, the PlayStation Network ever since they had this uh, hack that went on. Um, and it never has done it with The Last of Us until last night. Um, like I said in my previous video. Um, I just, I'm blown away by it. It literally shows like a connection thing. And I'm um, sitting there wondering what the hell, you know, I know what it is, but I'm wondering if it's my internet. My internet speeds are perfect. I checked them. So it has to be something to do with the uh, service. Um, I'm going to change my uh, ethern. I'm going to hook it. I'm going to direct connect it instead of playing it on my Wi-Fi because I used to be able to play this on my Wi-Fi. But now I can't play on Wi-Fi, so that kind of sucks. So I'll have to direct connect it. Um, but I had before, it was like I could play on Wi-Fi with no issues. And uh, you'll see in this video how it goes into the whole, like it'll show like a little connection sign. And then after this video, I show you the 30 frames, 60 frames, and the connection issues with The Last of Us. I want to show you what's been going on with Plants vs. Zombies. Um, it isn't like it all the time, these, these games, but The Last of Us, I have ran into this problem uh, last night and today a lot. And I'm not running into another issue too when I'm in the match It literally kicks me out of the match, you know, it just goes back to the, the main screen and uh, I'm not sure what's going on uh, See I will say one thing my internet. I have had issues with charter. They had a, a nationwide uh, outage But that's all fixed So I don't think it's charter. I'm assuming it's uh PSN. Right. Well, I can. I don't know. I'm not to tell. Um, I really get annoyed when I have to call all these companies and ask them a million questions. And, you know, a lot of these assholes that work at these places, they're just looking at a screen and they're troubleshooting your problems, just like you would do if you were to, um, you know, go on, uh, you know, a site and it says troubleshooting and. You know, that's what, what they're doing. Same thing. They've never played a fucking PlayStation 4. Um, they're, my, they're not even probably... The charter people aren't even using their internet service. They're probably... You know what I'm saying? They're probably in another fucking country with Comcast somewhere. You know what I'm saying? They're probably using Comcast. But other than that, this is what it looks like at 60 frames. To me, it's a big difference. Um, it's a lot faster. Um, it's like night and day. I, I enjoy it a lot more. Um, hands down, I'm, I, I would choose the remastered version over the regular version on PS3 any day. And I would definitely play in 60 frames instead of locking it at 30 frames. I don't know who would want to lock it at 30 frames. I just like to see the difference, but I always play at 60 frames. But I'm really thoroughly enjoying this game. Uh, if you have never played The Last of Us and you own a PS4 uh, or even a PS3, get The Last of Us, and if you own the PS4, get The Last of Us Remastered, it's well worth it. Um, it's one of my favorite online multiplayers ever. Um, that's, that, that speaks a lot, you know, I mean, just being honest, uh, I don't know. But yeah, this is The uh, Last of Us, uh, it should be running into that issue I was talking about in just a few seconds, it should be coming up on that issue, but I, I was blown away by it, you know, I was, I'm just getting kind of annoyed with it. I had one friend that I play with on a PlayStation 4, on a PlayStation Plus, or whatever the hell you want to call it, PSN, that he says he's almost going to get an Xbox One over this, but then I taught people and Xbox One has problems too, so you can't win either way, you know. I'm going to give it the time, see there it is, the connection issue. That's what I'm talking about, you see this little connection sign. 
and it literally locks up your player to where you can't even fucking move you know and it's agitating because you know they can still kill me <laughs> and I can't even fucking move you know so I don't know but yeah pretty much throughout this scene you'll see it happen more and more and then I'm gonna go into the plants versus zombies where pretty much it is completely unplayable it's even worse than this like literally my character is just lagging like crazy and I had one that was even worse and I, I thought I recorded it that my my character in plants vs zombies was literally all over the fucking screen without even me move, moving them on the controller I could just stand still and it was all over the fucking screen just bouncing everywhere and it was it was just unreal um, but I didn't I can't find that clip but I got another clip that's you know almost just as bad you know and I'm not sure if it was one where I was playing with uh, Wolf Flow and Clown Me, because they, I told them about it, and then they started lagging too. Like, it was like the next round, and I wasn't lagging. So I know it can't be my internet, that's what I'm saying. Because they live in, you know, completely different states. So, that, that's all I'm saying about that. Um, but yeah, uh, check out the rest of this footage, you'll see The Last of Us, how it's, you know, it'll start locking up. Like here, this where it gets really bad. And I, I can't even move to kill that guy. I just, you know, oh, I couldn't even get the execution. And uh, it just it gets worse from then on. And then pretty much, I think a minute more, I'll be cutting right into Plants vs. Zombies, and you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. But thank you, YouTube. I should ha be having a podcast um, today. I'm wanting to do either Dave's Tiny Enough Show or Dave and Dirty Movie and Shows podcast. Or shit, we might do both. Who knows? But thank you for the support lately, guys. I appreciate it. Shout out to Justin Wheeler. I talked to him for about, I don't know, about three hours uh, last night on PlayStation Plus, PSN, whatever you want to call it. He's a really cool dude. Shout out to you, man. All right, and that's all I got. Later, guys. You about to eat about to wide, y'all.